Over the past several weeks, as Mark and I have had the privilege to work with so many of Premier's clinicians from around the country, we've had the privilege to see the very best that humanity has to offer. And in a time of uh, that we're in right now, it'd be so easy for one to think only of oneself. But we've heard so many stories of our, of our staff that have gone above and beyond the call of duty and compromising nothing to offer exceptional patient care. Your dedication and perseverance are truly humbling. We are so proud to have you as members of our Premier family. While well, Laura and I would love to meet each and every one of you in person, express our appreciation and admiration for what you do, we realize that's not feasible right now. And never have the words, thank you, seem so inadequate but those are the words we have. So thank you for your dedication, your compassion, and for choosing a life of servicing others. Thank you for showing up each and every day, for your unwavering commitment to your community, and for your ability to find motivation on the most hardest days. And thank you for stepping away from the safety and security of your home and family, and for putting aside your own personal fears as you take care of someone else's loved ones. Thank you for your compassion and your reassuring presence as you help your patients and their family members navigate these ever-changing guidelines. And thank you for pushing through the stress and fatigue and for your willingness to take extra shifts and responsibilities to ensure that there's no lapse in care. We thank you for your flexibility, your resourcefulness, and your dedication as we work with the community to provide you the most current up-to-date information for you to do your jobs to the best of your ability. Laura and I are both truly blessed and we appreciate things every day that, that our, our staff do uh, for, for our organization. And we, we look forward to that day that we can meet you in person, look you in the eyes, shake your hand, and thank you. Uh, and thank you for your, your, your service that you've done. But until that time comes, we realize it's not an opportunity to do right now, but stay safe.